So we've come to one of Norfolk's only hills to give you a down the range demonstration of just what our night vision devices can do. Um, we have range found the targets at 50, 100 and 150 meters. Um, and I've also brought these along to give you a visual demonstration of just what the um, night sights can do. So those of you working in construction, these are retro reflect reflectors and they'll basically mimic the eyes of a fox or a rabbit and reflect back any infrared light that lands upon them. And they also have these Firebird exploding targets, just for a bit of fun to just show you uh, that we are actually hitting our target and haven't made it up. So here are the units on the scope and we have an iPhone that's pointed directly at the screen to get the picture. So please bear that in mind when you're uh, judging the quality of the unit. So because we're filming the screen rather than getting an image straight off the camera, the quality is not as good, but I hope that it will be good enough to sort of show you, um, you know, how good this unit is for the price. So this is the target at 50 yards. Um, this is the target at 100 yards. As you can see, you can still read out the PNV TV. Let's adjust the torch here. Right, and then here's the target at 150 yards. So you can still make out the silhouette of the rabbit. So that's your target recognition. Um, yeah, we can make that out. And you can clearly see the eye shine from the retro reflectors. So we're now going to have a shot at them and see if we can hit them and get them to explode. So wish me luck. So just adjusting the parallax. Okay, so that was the 50 yard target. Now we're going to move out to the 100 yard target. So just going to adjust the parallax here. Hey, there we go, that's 100 yard, and now let's try the 150 yard target. So again, we're gonna adjust the parallax and the scope, and adjust the LED torch. So there you have it, there was the 50 yard target, the 100 yard target, and the 150 yard target. Just to show you how clear the classic night vision add-on is, um, and this was with the LED infrared torch, not the laser. Um, I just want to show you quickly the pop-up menu on the unit, so you can adjust the oh, brightness, contrast, saturation, language, and the uh, aspect ratio, be it that or that. There we go. Um, and yeah, please bear in mind that this is an iPhone which is strapped onto the back of the uh, scope facing the screen rather than recording off the camera like on the PARS units. Um, but any questions you have, please just contact me uh, on the Precision Night Vision contact page and I'll be happy to answer your questions. So here is the classic night vision add-on on an air rifle. Um, I realise that all of my targets so far have been miles away, they've been up to 150 yards. I've been shooting at them with my 17 HMR, just to show you how far um, they can see. But I realise that most people who are after night vision do it on an air rifle, so I just want to show you how clear of an image you can get when it's closer up. So this one here is at um, 25 yards. This one here next to the knockdown targets is at 35 yards. And finally this one is at 45 yards just to show you the clarity of it. So here we'll have a shoot at some of the knockdown targets. And see if we can reset them. There you go. So here you have it, classic night vision add-on just show you how clear it is at uh, closer ranges 
that you'd be shooting at with an air rifle.